tonight, a tragic lesson in just how serious peanut allergies can be. A 13-year-old girl in California died after taking one bite of a treat that she didn't know contained peanuts. NBC's Mike Tassell reports that even immediate medical care couldn't save her. This is a picture of 13-year-old Natalie Georgie taken with friends at Camp Sacramento in Eldorado County hours before her death. Kelly Brothers, a family friend, was there and told me she was enjoying the last day of an annual multi-family summer camping trip. Beach, horseshoes, bonfire, dance, hula hoop contest. It was a slice of Americana. It was a perfect day. But it was a day that turned deadly when this girl, a girl with a diagnosed peanut allergy, took a bite of a Rice Krispie treat that she didn't realize was covered with a peanut butter frosting. Brothers said even though the girl spit out the treat, within 20 minutes, she was vomiting and going into anaphylactic shock even as her father, a doctor, use life-saving measures, including injecting multiple EpiPins, which are used to stop an allergic reaction. Her dad's a doctor, and they couldn't save her from one bite of a Rice Krispie treat. Roseville doctor Travis Miller specializes in food allergies and says the number of peanut allergy incidents has tripled in the past 10 years. The reason why, still unknown. There's some theory that we dry roast our peanuts in the United States. Most of the other places in the world boil their peanuts and that that could be creating a more allergenic peanut. Regardless, Kelly Brothers, who watched as this girl went from making this lanyard at camp early in the day to dead by night, all because of a reaction to peanuts, says no one should ever again roll their eyes when confronted with a separate peanut table set up in the school cafeteria or when asked not to eat peanuts on an airplane. It's heartbreaking. It, I mean, it if you could have been at campsite and saw the resources that were there, huh? helicopters and paramedics and nurses and a doctor and and they're all working on her and it was one bite of a rice krispie tree and it killed her a 13 year old girl i mean how much more serious could it be mm. really sad georgie's mm. family released a statement today saying their hearts are breaking but they're hoping others can learn from this that Food allergies are life-threatening. It is estimated about 8% of children in the United States have food allergies. Coming up 